Hello. Next week in Geneva, we will be concluding the World Humanitarian Summit consultation process. As I look back at the road travelled so far, I am amazed by the wealth of information we have collected. 23,000 people from different nationalities and over 150 countries, background, age, gender and walks of life have expressed their hopes for a future where humanity overcomes all. My heartfelt thanks to all of you for your tireless engagement, but above all for your confidence and the way you have placed your confidence in the Secretary General's World Humanitarian Summit initiative. In Geneva, we will celebrate the achievement of this truly global, multi-stakeholder consultation, which has built the necessary trust and ground-truthing of the emerging themes, proposals and recommendations. The evidence base of gaps, challenges and opportunities gathered in the report will inform humanitarian action for years to come. The synthesis report is also a genuine reflection of the consultations and highlights the aspirations of countless people for solutions for our fellow global citizens affected by disasters and conflicts around the world. It gives us the inspiration to rally around the principle of humanity. To all participants of the global consultation, I encourage you to seize the opportunity to highlight some of the critical proposals that have emerged from the consultations and congregate around the call to put people at the heart of humanitarian action. To those who will not be able to attend the global consultation, I ask you to interact with us through social media and with the hashtag ReshapeAid and hashtag ShareHumanity. I encourage you to watch the live stream of the global consultation and send us your questions through Pigeonhole. You can also visit the website voices.worldhumanitarian.summit.org to highlight which proposals of the synthesis report you think are most critical. The global consultation will complete the consultative process and launch the next phase of action to address the most pressing humanitarian challenges of today and tomorrow. Be part of this truly remarkable endeavour.